the present video is the solution of uh, gate EC 1999 problem on memories. The problem is of uh, two marks and uh, it is the first problem in this set of uh, four problems uh, being considered here. Uh, it is observed that uh, mostly the uh, problems uh, uh, based on memories are quite simple to solve if you can uh, well understand the problem. The circuits uh, involved may be quite complex but the solution of the problem is uh, relatively much simpler. So we'll start with this uh, present problem subgate 1999 f of 2 marks and it is on memories. The problem states that if uh, CS equals to A15 bar A14 A13 is used as the chip selects logic of a 4K RAM in an 8085 system then its memory range will be. There are four options that uh, this particular 4K RAM chip would have the memory addresses as uh, these four options and you have to find out which is the uh, best option here for this uh, particular memory of 4K RAM which is interface to 8085 microprocessor. Okay, we see the solution of this. It's uh, given here that uh, memory is of 4K RAM and it is uh, a part of 8085 system. Since it is of 4K RAM, uh, it would need uh, 12 address lines. That means 2 to the power 12. Okay, it will need uh, 12 address lines. Uh, to address 4K RAM and uh, the chip select signal uh, CS is given here A15 bar A14 A13 ok this is the chip select signal uh, when this chip select signal whether it's active low or active high the chip would be selected that means RAM chip would be selected for this logic. That means A15 would be low, A14, A13. So we take uh, 12 address lines. These address lines would be from A0 to A11. Make 12 address lines. And we take A12 to be 0 here. And uh, that will give me one address uh, range. And when I take A12, uh, as one it will give another address range. So we will see that the starting address here since it's a uh, uh, 16 bit word so the starting at uh, 16 bit address so it will have like A15, A14, A13 up to A0 so we know here A15 is 0 A14, A13, 1, 1 and A12 is taken here 0 and these up to A11 to A0 give me the corresponding address lines starting address we are taking as 0 so all these will be 0 and the corresponding final address uh, would be here 0 1 1 0 will remain same and the address would be all ones here that's the maximum address and if we put this in the hexadecimal form, we notice here it's a 6000 H hexadecimal to 6 FF hex. Okay, so this is the one address uh, location where this memory could be located. And if we take A12 as 1, then the corresponding address uh, would be the same, but uh, it would A12 would be 1 in this location and if we do that way what we find is the address comes out to be 7000 hex to 7 ff f hex so there are two address locations uh, 
uh, as being uh, shown here, uh, in, as per the option, there have been uh, option D here. This option D here has two locations, like 6000 hex to 6 FFF hex and 7000 H to 7 FFF hex. So this option right D is the right choice because uh, this uh, RAM could have both the address uh, locations or address ranges. Okay. Thank you.